well. His Bible meant a lot to him, and between me and him, the rest of the family, my mom and my wife were a bit slow, but we'd always engage in a competition for reading the Bible and discuss the mortality and all these things of life. He understood that his position was temporary and it would always end. Leading up to his death, he almost knew that his time was up. Despite having very many plans for the military and, and for his family. But he spoke in a certain tone that would suggest that, my son, uh, I won't always be here and you will need to take care of my wife and my other children, which I am more than ready to do and it will not be a problem. And Matthew, Matthew 5, 3, Beatitudes of Jesus, it says that blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. He was the poorest man in spirit. Easy chasers, mingi, office, kupwa, watu kumuita, CDF, general, sir. To him it was all vanity. It was a necessary thing for him to be able to fulfill his job. Nothing more. As he lays here uh, with his uniform, I see they put his medals, his sword and boots. He loved 